a little dumbbell. Have a great day at the plaza. Ah, thanks, Mommy. Pippi! Yeah. Well, looky here! It's the two liquid shrimps playing together in the park! Oh, so adorably lame! <laughs> Daryl, I kinda get why you guys are always invading the plaza, but why do you have to be so rude while you do it? Because I'm a crude dude with titanium alloy attitude. That's why. That is not why. Yes, it is. What do you know anyway, four eyes? About robots? Lots. Your insults are just a program function executing itself. When your sensors detect an enemy that is logged in your database, like KO, for instance, the insult generator loads a rude remark that has been flagged in that hero's info file. No, uh -huh. Let's perform a test. Try to insult this tree. Uh, er, you tree? No, wait! No, wait! Let me try again! You have leaves, you tree! Tree is not logged in his enemy database, therefore he cannot insult it. Haha, <laughs> you can't insult a tree. I can't too insult a tree. I, I just don't want to. Know what I want to do instead? Crush you! You can't do this, KO! you were fighting, I came up with a design for a new hack. If I can hack into the Boxmore Robots Insult Generator program and link it to the same biometric feedback system the PAL cards use, I can make it so that when a robot insults you, it will actually earn you coolness. Seriously? I am almost always serious. Where do I sign up? I do not require you to sign anything. Yeah, I meant... How did we get this awesome hack going? Okay, next time you get into a battle with Daryl, you need to stall for exactly two minutes. Two minutes? That's how long it will take me to remotely install the hack. So I need to fight a Daryl for two whole minutes? Correct. Time to turn the tables on Daryl! <laughs> Oh! 
I was looking for just the wimp shrimp I was looking for check this out trees are dumb trees are wimps and losers ha! so your silly little friend was wrong you just added trees to your database didn't he is never wrong Daryl she's gonna make you sorry for being such a Rudy two-shoes Rudy Two Shoes? <laughs> Someone needs to upgrade your insult generator, loser! Care to dance for exactly two minutes, Daryl? Avoid a, a battle!
hacked. Daryl is hacked. We just need to test it out. Did you think it would be that easy? There's more me where I come from. Loser! What? What was that? What just happened? Tell me, you shrimp! <gasps> I just got cooler! And you helped me! You're lying! You're a loser liar! Just got cooler! I don't get it! You, you, loser wimp dummy! Ah, feel the cool! The hack definitely worked. Cool hack, Denny. You're a genius. Those goofs had better watch their goofin' mouths, or you'll be the coolest kid in the plaza. <laughs> <laughs> A job that only you can handle. Really? Well, I asked Enid and Rad first, but they gave me a ton of attitude about it. Now that I'm a level zero, my defenses against teen angst are much weaker. So you need me? Yep, you're my man. Boy, some critters have been ripping apart the garbage over in Teen Alley. It's a mess. I need you to hide out near the dumpsters and catch the critters trash handed. Give them a scare so they get the picture that the plaza's garbage is off limits. You mean you want me to be a garbage boy? Uh, kinda, yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm honored. I will be the best garbage boy the plaza has ever seen. That's the spirit, K.O. K.O. I also know just how to sneak up on these garbage meddlers. Time to sneak out the trash. It smells 
else in here. Get this over with, Raymond. I'm older, so I command you to dig through garbage, sister. You're getting your claws dirty, too. Or I'll tell Daddy. So you're the critters that have been mucking around in our dumpsters. Ah, the garbage talks. We must report this to Daddy. <sighs> it's that kid with the headband, Shannon. He's inside the can. It wasn't critters. It was box move. It's true. Boxmore has been rooting through your garbage all along. And you'll never stop us. Although I kind of wish you would. Yeah, this job stinks. Let's just fight this kid and tell Daddy we couldn't get any garbage today. Wait, so you don't want to root through our garbage? Of course not. Gross. Do we look like garbage sorting robots to you? Then why are you doing it? Because Daddy told us to. He's kind of obsessed with you Lakewood losers. He thinks we could gain a tactical advantage by studying what's in your trash. Yeah, and we don't want to disappoint Daddy. So you're just following orders? Trying to make your dad proud? Hmm, maybe we can help each other for once. You don't want to go digging through the garbage. And I don't want to destroy you. What did you just say, twerp? Easy, Raymond. The twerp's on to something. I'll pick through the trash and give you some stuff to take back to Boxmore. And you guys promise to leave the dumpsters alone. Deal. Whatever. some primo bodega trash for you. Ugh, what took you so long? Jeez. Here you go. One banana peel. All strong heroes need potassium. How could something so mushy be related to strength? Living matter is bizarre. One slightly soiled headband. Once worn by a really, really heroic hero. Olfactory sensors detect nitro nacho cheese stain. Bingo! Okay, and last but not least, some of Mr. Gar's mustache grease. He 
Yep, he combs this stuff in nearly every day. So, we good here, evil robots? I think this is a satisfactory haul of useless plaza trash, yes? Later, loser. And like, thanks, I guess. You're welcome, Shannon. Fight you later. It smells in here. Duty. What the what? Leo? Is that you in there? I told you to take care of the trash, not become it! Turns out, it wasn't critters tearing apart the dumpsters. It was a Shannon and a Raymond. What the what? Boxmore? I wonder what Boxmore wants with our trash. They said it was to learn some uh, tactical advantages? Robot goofs? It's just trash! So did you get hurt fighting them? Are you okay, K.O.? Yeah, we scratched each other's backs. I gave him some of our junk and made him promise not to mess with our trash anymore. Good work, K.O. Just out of curiosity, what did you give him? A banana peel, my old headband, and an empty tube of your mustache goop. I see. Well, no harm in any of that. Good thinking, K.O. so fast, K.O. In my experience, saying a tough one-liner before a battle always gives you the edge. All right, here goes. Yeah. Garbage Boy is gonna take out the mechanical trash. Nice one-liner, K.O. Thank <laughs> you. 
Hey, uh, K.O., did I just see that boss use a weaponized mustache? Uh, yes, sir, it did. Let's maybe not give Boxmore any more of our trash, okay? Yes, sir. Alrighty. I'm impressed, K.O. Hi! Ta-da! Check it out! Ha! KO.
little twerp KO. What is his card's Powie Zowie program to be? Says here the cuticlism. He radiates pure cuteness and everything in its path experiences shucks and oh. No, no, that won't do at all. I need you to change his Powie Zowie to something that will spell ruin for the plaza and cause all his friends to turn on him. The Powie Zowies aren't chosen at random. They're derived from the characteristics of each hero. They need to fit. Trust me, this will fit K.O. like a glove. <laughs>